So this is my latest and greatest scent. I'm calling it the Fizzle Loop Scent 2, named after the Fizzle Loop Scent 1, surprisingly. But this one's a lot more complicated than the first one I built. Um, I'll show you the insides of it. So we have four 555 timers. Yes, four of them. I've got a couple of um, uh, caps. Well, there's a lot of caps, but these ones are removable, so I can change the sound if I want to at some stage. Uh, there's a bunch of pots and speakers and a shitload of uh, wires you can see there. Um, it took me three shots to get this right, but I managed to do it in the end. Um, yeah, so let's hear what it sounds like. Alright, so I'm going to show you what this thing sounds like. I'm going to reset everything to the lowest I can go, and then uh, we'll start from there. It takes a little while to kick in, I think it's just all the caps and timers and everything else.
That's it, that's all she wrote. That's a lot of fun. I haven't mastered it yet, but there's a ton of sounds that can come out of this thing. Um, I'm having a bunch of uh, good times messing about with it, um, knowing the neighbors and my wife and my kids and everyone else. But um, if you wanna make your own, check out the link in the YouTube clip to my instructors page. It's not an easy build. If you haven't built anything like this before, then I suggest don't do it but uh if you've messed about with 555 timers and you want to you want to push it a little bit then uh, it's a really it's a fun build and really all it is is um it's two uh 555 timers that use a flashing led um build and there's also uh, a light theremin um in there as well and i just stick them all together and you can get this so have fun um and yeah enjoy cheers